Welcome to our vocabulary building session. Today, we'll explore a word that connects us to ancient traditions and a rich cultural heritage, shofar. Shofar! Picture yourself in a vibrant and diverse cultural celebration where people gather to mark important occasions with music and symbolism. In the midst of this event, you hear a distinctive and powerful sound that resonates with history and spirituality. That sound comes from the shofar. Let's work on the pronunciation. Say it with me, S-H-O-H-Far. Now, repeat after me, shofar. Shofar. Listen to real situation with the word shofar, and try to repeat the word in the sentence. Now I don't know nothing about that. Oh, the never blowed no chauffeur. Listen again and repeat. Now I don't know nothing about that. Oh, the never blowed no chauffeur. It's a chauffeur. Listen again to this situation and repeat. It's a shofar. The blowing of the shofar symbolizes many things. Listen again and repeat. The blowing of the shofar symbolizes many things. Shofar is a noun that refers to a musical instrument made from a ram's horn, typically used in Jewish religious and cultural ceremonies. It holds deep historical and spiritual significance. The shofar is an integral part of Jewish tradition. It is sounded during special religious observances, such as Rosh Hashanah, the Jewish New Year, and Yom Kippur, the Day of Atonement, as well as other significant moments in Jewish life. Here are some sentences to help you understand how to use shofar in context. Example 1, during Rosh Hashanah, the shofar is blown as a symbol of the Jewish New Year. Repeat this example again and try to pronounce the word shofar correctly. Example 2. The sound of the shofar echoed through the synagogue, marking the start of Yom Kippur. Please repeat the example again. Example 3. Rabbis have also interpreted the loud blast of the shofar as a wake-up call for the new year. Rabbi Charlie Schwartz called the sounding of the shofar the pinnacle of the Rosh Hashanah service in synagogue. Please repeat the example again. Here some usages related to the cultural and religious significance of the word shofar. Jewish tradition. The shofar holds a central role in Jewish tradition and is deeply symbolic. It is mentioned numerous times in the Hebrew Bible, the Old Testament, and is associated with important religious events and rituals. The word shofar is used also in Rosh Hashanah. One of the most significant uses of the shofar is during Rosh Hashanah, the Jewish New Year. It is sounded on both days of Rosh Hashanah, typically in synagogue services. The shofar blasts are meant to awaken spiritual reflection and repentance as Jews begin the High Holy Days. We can use shofar in Yom Kippur. The shofar is also sounded at the conclusion of Yom Kippur, the Day of Atonement. This marks the end of a 25-hour fast and a period of intense reflection and prayer. Let's recap. To recap, a shofar is a traditional musical instrument made from a ram's horn, used in Jewish religious and cultural ceremonies. Here is a quick example. The hauntingly beautiful sound of the shofar added a spiritual dimension to the ceremony. Now, it's your turn. Can you create a sentence using shofar? Share it in the comments below. To explore more words and expand your vocabulary, check out our channel videos and podcasts related to English learning. Fantastic! You have learned a new word today, shofar. It's a reminder of the diversity and depth of language and culture.
It's important to approach the word shofar with cultural sensitivity, as it holds profound significance in Jewish traditions. Learning about different cultures and their practices enriches our understanding of the world. Stay tuned for more vocabulary lessons in our future videos.